It's easy to add the Google Currents community. The first thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to click the little house in the corner and that's going to bring me to OCSB Central, the new staff portal. Once you're logged in, I'm going to scroll to the search field and type the word currents and press enter. I'm going to click the currents icon. If this is your first time using Google Currents, you may be prompted to sign in with Google. Go ahead and sign in with your OCSB.ca account. The next thing that we're going to do is we're going to learn how to join a community. So I'm going to click over here on the left in communities. And you can browse ones that you're a part of right here. So the, a popular one is the announcements and events. You can scroll to the bottom and discover more. Here is retirements. You can click, if you'd like to uh, join that one, you can click on join. And then you're, you're joined that community group. Um, other ones that are popular is this for sale one. You can see their obituaries and other amazing learning experiences as well. You can also search up here in the search bar. So I can search for sale and click there. So once you're in the community page, what you can do is click over here and click on join the community. It's really that easy. You can also choose your preferences and settings to how you would like to receive notifications about your communities. One useful setting down here under notifications, if you click the tiny little arrow besides posts, you can choose how you want to be notified. So if you would like to be notified when someone shares a post with you directly, you can toggle that to the blue on. And then for your communities, you can turn this on, uh, someone shares something with the community and you'll get a notification from that. So all these are default on. And since we are belonging to the community, you will get an email notification about that. 